Kate Middleton and Meghan Markle gave Simona Halep an extra boost to win Wimbledon. Simona Halep defeated Serena Williams during Saturday's Wimbledon final, winning 6-2, 6-2. Simona Halep loved seeing royal tennis fans Kate Middleton and Meghan Markle in the stands during her big Wimbledon win. During her on-court interview immediately following the match, where the 27-year-old Romanian player defeated Serena Williams, Halep was quick to thank the royal moms for coming to watch. It's an honor to play in front of the royal box, she shared, before learning that as the winner of the matchup, she would get a chance to meet Kate and Meghan. That's amazing. I didn't know that. So it's even more special now, she shared, as the camera cut to Meghan and Kate in the stands, as the two women smiled and applauded the athlete. While making her trip up to the royal box, cameras also caught the sweet moment Halep was introduced to Kate. You played an incredible game, the 37-year-old royal told the tennis star. It was really, really impressive, so congratulations and enjoy the celebration. Halep went on to praise Kate as being very kind. It was an honor to play in front of her and I had the chance to meet her after the match, she shared during a press conference, as she once again shared how much it meant to her to have so many members of the royal family in attendance. In addition to Kate and Meghan, the Duchess of Cambridge's sister Pippa Middleton also joined in on the fun day out. It was an extra boost when I saw them there, the royal family. You know, winning in this position, it's very nice, it's unforgettable, the tennis player added. In a post-match press conference, William said that having Meghan's support and friendship is great. She's such a great friend and a great person as well. And always positive, no matter what, she remarked adding that the royal is also happy for Simona. She saw that she played unbelievably, and that's just the kind of person that she is, Williams explained. Meghan Markle and Kate Middleton are having a royal mom's day out. The sisters-in-law attended at the ladies' singles final at Wimbledon on Saturday, recreating their first ever joint outing, without their husbands, from one year earlier. Arriving ahead of Meghan, Kate was the first to arrive at the sporting event wearing a green Dolce & Gabbana dress, which she had previously worn during a royal tour in Canada with husband Prince William in 2016. Ahead of the match, the royal was also seen meeting with junior players from Russia, Latvia, and France. As a patron of the All England Lawn Tennis & Croquet Club, Kate had to arrive early in order to carry out her official duties. Another reason why the pair arrived separately is because they were arriving from separate homes. Although last year both royals were living in Kensington Palace, Meghan and her husband Prince Harry have recently moved to Frogmore Cottage, which is located about 25 miles from their former home. Joining Kate, Meghan was all smiles as she arrived wearing a white button-down shirt which she paired with a pleated white skirt with a blue design from Hugo Boss. Joining the two royal mums for their fun day out was Kate's sister Pippa Middleton which marked the first time all three women made a public appearance together. All three women gathered to watch Meghan's close friend Serena Williams take on Romania's Simona Halep. Kensington Palace went on to post several photos from the royal outing on Instagram. The Duchess of Cambridge, at Wimbledon Patron, and the Duchess of Sussex attended the hashtag Wimbledon Ladies Singles Final today, the post read. Well done to Serena Williams and Simona Halep on a fantastic match and congratulations Simona on your first Wimbledon title. Last year, Meghan and Kate made a highly anticipated appearance in Centre Court's Royal Box for the same finals match, when Williams fell short to Angelique Kerber. The Royals coordinated their outfits for the event, the Duchess of Sussex choosing a summery blue and white striped shirt from Ralph Lauren with wide leg cream pants, while Princess Kate opted for a white pattern dress. Saturday's outing will mark return trips to Wimbledon this summer for Kate and Meghan, both 37. Kate surprised royal fans with an appearance at the tennis tournament on July 2, but rather than take her normal seat in the royal box, she headed over to Court 14 to watch British player Harriet Dart play American Christina McHale. The royal mom of three, who sported a white shirt dress with buttons down the front accessorized with an Alexander McQueen belt chic sunglasses and her signature blowout, 
later headed to center court where she then took her seat in the front row of the royal box to see Tatiana Maria play Angelique Kerber. Meghan cheered on Williams two days later, sitting within the stands with friends Lindsay Roth and Genevieve Hillis. The new mom to son Archie, born May 6, wore the Brea jacket by Legends with a pair of her favorite Outland denim jeans, the Harriet, which is the same style she wore in Australia, and Finley and Co.S. Henrietta sunglasses. Both Meghan and Kate, who is also patron of the All England Lawn Tennis and Croquet Club, have been fixtures at Wimbledon for years. Meghan previously attended the tournament in 2016, around the same time she was set up on a blind date with future husband Prince Harry. And Kate has said the tennis tournament is a quintessential part of English summer. I was really taken by Agassi and Sampras, Ivan Isevic and Steffi Groff, she said in 2017. That for me was my first memories. The royal moms also stepped out together this week for a big family outing. They brought all four kids, including one-year-old Prince Louis and two-month Archie, to cheer on Prince William and Prince Harry in a charity polo match. An onlooker tells people that Meghan mainly stayed under the shade of a tree with her son in her arms. She was doting on him, there's no doubt about that, an onlooker tells people. She was kissing and stroking him and bouncing him up and down. Meanwhile, Kate was busy chasing after Louis as Prince George, 5, and Princess Charlotte, 4, kicked a soccer ball and showed off some dance moves before heading to the car for a picnic. It's a busy weekend for both royal women. Kate is set to return to Wimbledon on Sunday with Prince William for the gentlemen's singles final while Meghan and Prince Harry will hit the red carpet for the London premiere of The Lion King.